it was living hell. <laughs> to be blunt about it, it uh, it was awful. It was just, it was every movement you were just waiting for it to to shock you, and uh, it just wore you out. And it was it was it was just not being able to really chew, bite in, you know, bite into anything. Um, or roll over in bed without being shocked. I was sleeping sitting up so it wouldn't happen, um, which wasn't great. We did research online, which is wonderful, <laughs> but it about the uh, gamma knife, and so we decided to try that. It's a little more involved than the than the cyber knife, but it uh, involves a halo on your head and you have screws screwed into your skull and you have to hold real still. Well, I moved here to, to Louisville to help take care of my grandchildren and uh, they had start getting shocked again. So um, anyway, then I, I saw Dr. Nada. He did surgery. It was five hours of, of surgery and it took about a probably a month to really recover from that um, in the hospital four or five days. But again, when, when the pain from the surgery went away, there was no more, no more pain from the trigeminal nerve. Then two years later, here it comes again in a different place. And I uh, decided, well, I talked to Dr. Nada again and he recommended, he said he could do surgery again, but we asked about the uh, this cyber knife, and he said we could try that. So we I w went into Dr. Wu and had a had a, an appointment, and uh, decided to set that up and give that a shot. <laughs> and I did, and it worked beautifully. And it was so much easier than the anything else I had done. This is what it ends up being like. They mold it to your face. They put a, a this is all like fabric, and uh, they get it wet and put it over your face, and you have to hold still for a while, and uh, then it comes off, and this is what they get, and they put the plastic around it, and here are the little holes. I guess it screws down so you don't move around. Instead of having holes drilled in your head, it's drilled in the plastic here, and this holds you still, and uh, that was it. I just kind of meditated for a while and didn't move and it was done. It was great. Uh, she has trigeminal neuralgia. Trigeminal neuralgia is really diagnosed clinically. Um, it, has, it has very typical symptoms of one-sided facial pain and this is really the simplest uh, treatment. It's one treatment, outpatient, takes an hour um, and and that's that. Now it has some side effects, but it's not a high degree of side effects. The major side effects is that you may have uh, some numbness, which could be permanent on the same side of the face. And my understanding is she had great relief of, of her pain. Two years later, here I am. <laughs> Doing great, still Good. smiling and can eat and roll over on my pillow without <laughs> waking up, it's great. I'm back to normal, watching, watching my grandchildren and, and uh, S smiling and yeah, it's uh, it's just great to be able to to live normally again.